Hello and welcome to episode 7 of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke Challenge. Oh, what is the point of going on, you guys? Uh, if you missed it last episode, we lost our dear friend Pego, the Mankey. Uh, it was a big loss. It was our first, like, real big loss. Uh, of course, Ben Jam the Spearow was a sad loss as well, but I have to tell you, morale is low. Morale is low, and aggression is high, and actually I had an idea. I think we're going to check in on Mr. Wayne here at the daycare center and see if he has grown enough to join the team. Do -do -do. So, hello daycare man. I'd say, low by nine. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, 1,000. Take it. Man, money is not a problem ever in Pokemon, except what level does that make him? Uh, in, except in the new ones, X and Y. I feel like I'm constant without money. Wow, Mr. Wayne is like all of a sudden up there. Okay, what do you, you got again? Maybe we'll, we'll switch, sure. Uh, damn it. Summary. What you got? We got Leech Life, Astonish, Supersonic, and Bite. So, still not that great. But at least we have Bite, that's good. So, maybe we can hit some Psychic types. Although Donatello has Bite, so, I don't know, Mr. Wayne. You're on the team, but I don't know about it. Um, I think I'm gonna leave Sony here. Let me do that real quick. Rock tunnel and through the rock tunnel and we'll probably end in Lavender Town, I think. So we'll see how we do. Woo! And we're flying. Route 9! That means we can catch someone new. Yeah, cut! Go Radigan! Actually, make sure everything's healed real quick. That would be bad. Okay, everything's good. Uh, who are we gonna lead with? Mm -hmm. uh, let's, you know what? Let's lead with none other than Donatello, because he needs to uh, unleash some hell on some people after the loss of Pego. What you got? Oddish? Ah, of course you do. Okay, well, we have the answer for that in uh, our Sansa here. Ugh, oh, how dare you! Your Oddish is nothing compared to my Rindin. Uh, so, speaking of Sansa, uh... You know, as, as we know, Sans and Pego did not always get on, but uh, Sansa has been nothing but upset about this, about this death. Um, doesn't show it much, as we know Sansa is incredibly proud, but I, I have a feeling she is really enjoying taking down all these Bellsprout real quick. There it was, the very first thing I was on. Okay, healed. <laughs> Item! Aerial Ace! That is good. We are gonna... Hmm. Probably use that pretty quick. Sans is already destroying everything. Think, I think Pidgeotto learns Aerial Ace, so I'm not sure if I want to waste it on that. Uh, uh, you know who would have been a good fight for this? Pego! What, are you getting pumped? For what? Donatello... Rapid spin? I don't think so. Maybe if this was like competitive battling, but it's not. Sorry, Donatello. You can. Not be. I feel like rapid spin should like potentially confuse you, right? That makes sense. Onyx. Dead. What you want, fool? Growlithe? You got nothing. Water gun! Oh god. Okay, you know what? This is gonna work out, because watch this. Boom. Ha ha ha. That was teamwork right there. Right again, you get some levels? Oh no! Are you kidding? Okay, we're still gonna switch back out, but <laughs> right again will get a level at long last. What do you know? For the random roar. I really hope we don't run I mean, it would be great to catch a freaking. It'd be great to catch a Growlithe, but they're like dangerous to run into as your first guy because uh, they can roar and then you can just be gone. Oh, I wasn't expecting the burn. Hope you brought your burn heal. I didn't. Okay. Well, we're going to have to go uh, heal before we continue on with that then. But before we do that, let's go try and catch something in this grass up here. With... Let's have Mr. Wayne. You can be our front man. Actually, no. Let's, let, let's have Rindin because Rindin uh, can put things to sleep and stuff. So let's see how that goes. Oh, and there's a stupid bug catcher first. Bug catcher Brent would like to battle. He said a bee drill. Go. Yeah. All right. 
Someone, uh, this is like the smartest bug catcher in the whole game who actually evolved his Weedle. But there's still no match for Senza. <laughs> what a waste of time. All right. New friend. You guys ready? You guys ready? Ah! Who is it? I can't, oh, okay. Duplicate cause. This will, uh, this will not count towards our potential catch. It'll just be someone for Sansa to destroy. Duplicate cause. Oh, oh. Spiro. Oh, my, okay. Okay, so to make a long story short, I ran around on the grass for like two minutes and did not run into anything we hadn't already caught. So, um, I'm going to count that as the duplicate clause not allowing us to catch anything on this particular route. So, the, uh, the two-edged sword strikes again. Oh, what do you want? Look at this. Hmm, is it worth the item? Of course! Go Sansa! Oh, I didn't switch. That's okay. Rindon! Kill the Geodude. Absorb his life force. Rindon drinks your blood, Onyx. <laughs> Wonderful. What was it for? A burn heal. Damn it! <laughs> That's funny. Because we just went back to the Pokemon Center to uh, heal up. And then I found the burn heal. So, there you go. Oh, hey! You know it's not good news for you, Bug Catcher Connor? Sansa! See, so you could have like a level 20 Butterfree. Oh man, Sansa is getting dangerously close to Pidgeot. And I know some of you guys told me that it's Pidgeot, and I really disagree. I think it's Pidgeot. And actually, I've looked it up, and both are acceptable, so let's not uh, split hairs. Venonat! That's cool. My bugs! Alright. Uh, let's put Rindon up front here. So, Rindon, I talked about last time, is, uh, never, like, never makes any sort of, like, facial expressions, or doesn't really, like, show emotion or anything. Um... And of course, Rindon really wasn't on the team long enough to like get to know Pego as well as maybe everyone else. Rindon to level 26. Um, but it's it's weird because everyone else is like noticeably like depressed, and Rindon uh, just continues to stand there, awkward as ever. I, honestly, it makes me uncomfortable being around because he just he just stands there, and the drool is coming out, and it's like, what do you, what do I do? But I, I mean, I can't complain because when I throw him out into battle here, like. Hello. He's just kicking butt all over the place. I think that when we... Freaking... What are you gonna have? Lass. Don't you dare patronize me. Okay. I was just trying to walk down. Go to the Pokemon Center. A Meowth. Okay. Ah. You're horrible, Meowth. Okay, Route 10. Okay, so we can actually catch something in this grass here, too, but I'm going to go to the... Actually, I'm really hoping it is an electric type, because I think electric types are insanely important when doing... Uh, this... When doing Fire Red or Leaf Green. What is it going to be? Ekans. Okay. Doesn't count. Doesn't count. Duplicate Claws. It strikes. What is it? Voltorb! Yay, Voltorb! Okay. We can take you down, buddy. Put you to sleep. Okay, I'm tempted to just throw the ball now. We'll just see. Maybe the sleep was enough. How many Pokeballs do we have? Okay, we have all. Alright, we can Great Ball him. Yeah. Two. Three. Yes! Voltorb! Welcome to the team. Voltorb's dad will be added to the Pokedex. A life form whose identity is unknown. It is said to screech or suddenly self-destruct. That's true. We actually have to be really careful if we run into future Voltorbs because they will self-destruct and that's a good way to die when Nuzlocking. Uh, what's your name going to be? Oh, oh, I'm going to I'm going to look up what are you guys names real quick. Hold on. Oh, actually, you know what? I know it's going to be. I don't need to look it up. Welcome to the team. Golden To deposit rat again. Sorry, we didn't really use you a whole lot. And joining the team will be Golden. Mwahaha. Oh, 
heal. And I think we need to teach somebody flash real quick. So let's see, what do we got here? Uh, it's gonna be golden. Because I think Rindin's gonna be more valuable to us. Should a move be? Yes, it should. Which move should be forgotten? Oh, well, Sonic Boom is actually not horrible this early in the game. He's just trying to. Okay, that's great, except we don't have another... Uh, we're just gonna get rid of Screech. Yeah. What do you want? Alright, let's see what Golden can do. But I always lose. Pikachu! Okay, so we're not gonna fight you with that. We know how to deal with Pikachu. Rindin. And then we poison powder because they're going to freaking double team. Yes! We win. Ugh, it was a Raichu that killed Pego. Clefairy! Hmm. You know who would have been good to fight Clefairy? Pego. Oh, that was a remarkably strong little bit of uh, double slapping there. Oddly, you have uh, forced me to heal myself, though, so I'm not that concerned as long as I don't keep getting paralyzed. And we enter the rock tunnel, which means we can catch yet another new friend today. Hooray. I thought we were going to catch three, and now we can only catch the two, because we had so many the same. Uh, Golden, light this place up, son. Okay, I am uh, probably not going to go about picking up every single uh, Geodude. Okay, we can catch him. We can catch him. We should be able to use Sonic Boom. Actually, this guy could have, um, like, Magnitude or something. And I don't want him to kill our guy. Uh, sleep Powder? Okay, we're going to try the, uh, the nap and Trap, as it were. Do we even need to injure him? Probably. Wow, that was so easy. Why do people even bother damaging the enemy Pokemon? <laughs> Alright. Welcome to the Team Geodude. Oh, now I have to look up you guys' names. Okay, hold on. Yes! We are naming you... Hicks. Go, Hicks. To the PC. Alright. The problem with Geodude with the Nuzlocke is that uh, you have to evolve Graveler by trading. Pokemon fight, ready, go! Yeah, if you say so, buddy. Just standing here in a cave like a weirdo. As they have to evolve Graveler via... Oh, God, everything in here is going to be stronger against you, Golden. Rindon! Suck his soul! Man, Rindon is going to be a boss in here. Bring it! Bring it! What you want? Actually, see, he could actually use, like, Confusion, and that would not be so cool. Oh, but he couldn't. Running grew to level 27. Bring it. And the problem with Graveler is that you have to trade to evolve into Golem. And I don't really know how to do that via the emulator. And I'm sure there's... Oh, it's an item I missed. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. I know, please don't yell at me for, like, missing items in this cave, because I just want to get through it, and... Yeah. Freaking manky. Okay. Ugh. And now we bring in Sansa, who must face the ghost of Pego with no problem at all. <laughs> oh boy. I'm gonna switch Golden out from the front because I don't think he's gonna get very much done up there. Uh, we're gonna put Donatello up front. Yeah. Ooh! I draw illustrations of Pokemon when I'm home. 
I bet for the rest of time you stand in this cave. Thank you for bringing up drawings while you're standing here in the dark. What are you drawing there? Donatello. We can handle you the same way we handled the li Oh no! We oh, you suck. You know who we should bring in here is Mr. Wayne to use a bite. <laughs> but we didn't. <clears throat> Heading to the rock tunnel. I used to, uh, I used to never get flash when I used the red and blue version because, um, I had, like, you could still see, like, the edges of the walls. A revive, though. Ah, worthless revive in Nuzlocke, right, though? Oh, too bad we didn't catch an Onyx. That would've been good. Donatello level 26. Yeah, and red and blue, I used to never get flash because I had to go through Diglett's cave and it took, like, extra time. And I could see the walls. And I could continue through the rock tunnel, and I'd like memorize the path, so it was like not hard. Which makes me sound like a total dork, but here I am at the grand age of 25 playing <laughs> uh, Fire Red for everyone to watch. Oh no, we're poisoned. That is really bad news inside this cave. We better have an antidote, or I'm gonna have a real problem here. Because, okay, God, this is actually real. This could be really bad. Oh God. Oh no, oh, we have an escape rope. Okay, well, I hate to do this, but I really cannot lose Sansa. And every step you take poisons you. So we are going to have to go back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, I got rid of Ratting and I can't use Cut. Oh no. Okay, hopefully we won't get poisoned again. Um, I'm gonna skip back to the part where I was, so see you in a second. Okay, we're back, and I did not fight anything along the way, so you didn't miss any leveling. There wasn't any potential risk of death. Uh, here we go. Actually, it was good because one of the things that is trickier about the rock tunnel is not always that things are gonna die, it's that uh, you run out of the, the PP, the power points, I guess that's what it stands for. Oh, Charmander, bring it on, son. Maybe if you were a Charmeleon, Psh, not even then. Uh, yeah, but you can run out of the, the power points, and that's what makes it harder, because you have to start using, like, non-super effective moves on stuff, and that's when you get into these longer fights, and you start taking big damage, uh, especially if you've fought so many trainers along the way. Ugh, but I'm thinking that's not going to be a huge issue. No. Since we got to go back. My Pokemon technique will leave you crying. Uh, I'm going to be crying laughing at how bad you are at this hiker, Alan. Actually, what could really be... Mm, what would really suck is if one of these... I know there's someone in here who was a Graveler. Who was like the infamous uh, exploding Graveler. Son of a... Hi. Hi, you bumba. Oh, he saw us. This tunnel goes a long way, kid. G good to know, hiker. Thanks for the information. I swear, some of the stuff the guys say to you right when you like run into them is so pointless. Like, why do I need to know that? And as you might expect, Donatello just rips through this team. <laughs> This is the guy with the Graveler, if I'm not mistaken, right there. <clears throat> Escape rope! Look, we replaced it. Good. Okay, so we're gonna leave Donatello out front, because I think he could take it if we didn't happen to kill the Graveler. Outsiders like, you need to show me some respect! It just, it, like, he's yelling it at me, as if... Uh, it's, whatever. There's the Geodude. No problem. Water gun. Yeah, now hopefully we'll have such a giant level advantage that it won't matter, but I know this thing self-destructs. Woo, we got him. I think we got the crit, too. Okay. Time to uh, give someone else the lead, I think, because Donatello is going to get way ahead of everyone. So I'm thinking we're going to, well, not much of a lead, but rend into the front. I should really give uh, some of the other members of the team a little more time to shine because Sansa and Donatello and Rindin, I feel like monopolize some of the video. So I don't, I don't know if you guys, uh, 
are enjoying the way I'm doing this, or if uh, you'd rather see some other guys rise up, I don't know, please let me know. Ah, this thing. I really wanted to catch a Jigglypuff. I think, no, we killed, did we kill one? I don't know. Dead. I went for the poison there in case they put us to sleep and then we could keep doing damage. Pidgey, oh boy, okay. You know who might, what level is this Pidgey? 21, hmm. I right, see, now, Golden doesn't have any electric moves yet, which stinks. Hmm. I will show you what a properly trained Pidgey should look like by now and embarrass you with your sand attack because obviously I cannot be hurt by such things. Excuse me. Meowth! You know, the ease with which I'm killing all these Meowths makes me feel like Sony, even if we ever have to go pick her up from the daycare, is not going to be that great. Although, uh, I noticed one of the weird things I thought, if you guys have watched Pokemon Origins yet, um, I would like just watch the series of like the sub version in Japanese and like one of the guys read as sorry spoiler alert it's not really that relevant at all but like one of the guys on his team at the end uh, in the Hall of Fame is a Persian and that seemed like so random to me that uh, that would be on his team but you know whatever it's good to see that you know they can branch out and not just strictly uh, use like Meowth and Persian as a 100% bad guy kind of thing. Woo! I, I kind of thought that Graveler was going to uh, explode on me as well. Hiker Dudley, oops, out muscled. Yeah, that's right, out muscled. Rindon takes no prisoners. No, we're not gonna fight that guy. I think this is like the gauntlet, like one, two, three, and then you're done. Except there's like guys outside of Lavender County. Eek, don't try anything funny in the dark. What do you think I am gonna do? I mean, you approached me. You don't try anything funny in the dark. Little girl, Leah, picnicker. Who's picnics inside of a cave? Just for that, just for the insinuation. Oh, freaking Sansa is like attracting all kinds of status problems today. <laughs> I guess that comes with the territory when I keep using her to fight plant types because Freaking, uh, I hate when they do the evasiveness stuff. It's so annoying. Uh, one more, one more. Come on. What is going on? Can I switch? I don't feel like it's going to matter, but. See, we should have given her aerial ace. God, that would have solved the problem. Mm. I can't risk this whole double slap nonsense. Take that, Clefairy. That was the hardest thing we fought in the whole freaking thing. The whole cave. Leah. You have Pokemon? Let's start! Yeah, I have Pokemon. They don't let you outside of your town and into the tall grass unless you have one. I'm so... I mean... Hmm. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's send in Donatello. Clean up this ruckus. Oh, no. What'd you... Hmm. Okay. I can play that game. I will use Donatello against you. Oh, I'm asleep. And I'm against the Bell Sprout. Mm. Sans is paralyzed. And you don't have any flying type attacks yet. Hmm. Could Golden do this? I oh god, critical hit. I feel like a Sonic Boom will take it out. Yes, I was right. Way to go, Golden. Stepping up. And we're gonna step out now because I don't want to get hyper -fagged. And we probably could have lived it, but. Way to go. Here we go. Rend in.
There we go, picnic cart Ariana, you are dead. Trapped in this cave with no healthy Pokemon. I think this is the last battle inside the cave. Milf! Oh! Joylet! We haven't seen Joylet this episode. Yeah, we got Intimidate on it, though. Do we think we can take the Pidgey with Joylet? Probably not, but... Oh, yeah, definitely not, in fact. <laughs> but we got Whirlwinded, so that's okay. Oh! And you accidentally brought in the big guns. Wow, was Sansa faster than Oddish even after paralyzation? Is that a word, paralyzation? I'm gonna heal. I got a little nervous there. Now we can wake up Donatello. Woohoo! And we have made it to Lavender Town. Except for these couple of trainers. Now yeah, let's fight them. You cannot hope to stand against me. Freaking. Golden, you really need to get an electric attack so that we can actually do some damage with you. Na, 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 na. It would have been great. Freak. Whirlwind becoming extra annoying. New level? Oh, no new attack. I could have given him Shockwave. God, I didn't even think of that. I've been trying to block Lieutenant Surge out of my mind. He ruined my day last time I had to deal with him. <clears throat> what? Five levels away, Sansa. We're getting close to Pidget. Pidgeot. Absorb! Another soul. It's a good thing you guys are so close to Pokemon Tower. Because you've got so many soulless Pokemon once Rindin finishes with them. I think there's an item right there. Woo! A Nanob Berry. Don't know what that does. And the final challenge. Oh, fine. Don't even. I demand a battle. Boom. There we go. We made it. So, welcome to Lavertown, Lavender Town. And the creepiest music in Pokemon. Woo! Well, thank you guys for watching uh, very much. Uh, let me know if there's anything you would like me to discuss in future videos. Uh, next time we will head into Lavender, or into Pokemon Tower and fight our rival Peaches. Give him the Royal Smackdown and head over to Celadon City. Maybe take on some rockets. Should be fun. I guess we have to do the rockets before Pokemon Tower. Never mind. I know what I'm doing. I promise. Uh, yeah. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe and click that like button if you enjoyed today's video. Bye.